themselves, they're nearly always generated by communities. And I think what I what I see as the waste is the waste that we make of, of that possibility of cooperative intelligence. Um, being an artist, you hear a lot of talk about genius, um, which is the process of singling out certain people in art history and saying those were the important ones, you know, Picasso, Rembrandt, Shostakovich, whatever. Whenever you look at any of those artists, you find that they they lived and drew from a very, very active, flourishing cultural scene. And they were only one of the elements in that scene. All these people who are called genius actually sat in the middle of something that I call senius. S-C-E-N-I-U-S. So just as genius is the um, creative intelligence of an individual, senius is the creative intelligence of a community. And what I want to see is more attention given to that possibility of, of creative behavior. So what that means, of course, is two things. One, one of them is the understanding that all people are born unequal, so everybody has a particular and unique set of gifts and talents, whatever they are. And secondly, that intelligence is um, generated by communities by cooperation of some kind. Um, so I suppose the, the thing about the, the biggest obstacle to that at the moment is that people have to earn a living. I often get asked to come and talk at art schools and I rarely get asked back because the first thing I always say is I'm here to persuade you not to have a job.
scares you. He flies off the handle. I see it now. I see what Tess was talking about. I told you this girl would shoot. She, uh, she left me. Tess left me. For six months, she went back into her parents. I know.
Lost someone. 
Dankeschön. Vielen lieben Dank.